I, I actually don't want to cut my hair to be honest. I don't know if I'm gonna do well. It goes nothing. Meanwhile. <laughs> Welcome back to another episode of Chibro. This is an all too familiar site right now. Uh, there's been an exponential increase in the number of mops on guys' heads. Jason and I are contributing statistics. Uh, I usually get my hair cut every three weeks. It's been about eight now. We were trying to think of solutions. And I had an idea. I challenged Jason to a quarantine self haircut contest. Dentist versus engineer edition. Now I have to do it because I because now it's a challenge. And you know I know that it's not gonna be worse than John's hair. That that's for sure. That's for sure. Knowing Jason, I already know he's gonna act all tough on camera. Because that's just how he is when we compete. But in actuality, he's very nervous. Yeah, but it makes it sound like you're only trying to do the size of your hair. Yeah. But That's not a haircut. You don't go to the hair salon to cut the size of your head. You get a haircut to style your hair. Man, that, that, that makes a lot of challenge. I'm gonna, I'm gonna come out with like a good hair, dude. That's what's gonna happen right after. Well, if you screw up, then we're in quarantine for like three more weeks. But dude, I'm in the same boat. Man, we might lose all their fans after that. <laughs> nah, nah. They wouldn't judge us for this. Alright. Alright, right, see you tomorrow. So how am I so confident that this will turn out okay for me? I had already planned, even before this competition, my hair to be cut by a co-resident who cuts hair on the side. He's been cutting hair since college. Please write J bro right over here. Just kidding. <laughs> I'll be getting my hair cut from him secretly while Jason struggles. Oh man, I just missed my bus. I thought I was gonna get here. Oh, it's raining hard. Oh, okay, let me go. I'm just squatting in front of this random church building. Um, so I ordered my clippers online and apparently it's gonna take six weeks for it to get here. And the, and the only person that I know actually who owns hair clippers in the city that I can go see is John. He's letting me borrow his hair clipper. So that's why I'm going all the way to Bronx. He's gonna come pick this up along with uh, this mirror here. We'll meet him in about 30 minutes. So in one of the stories, John asked me to do, do like a tell-all where I go completely unfiltered. I think it would be hilarious to get him to speak the same way that he does off camera. Talking about relationship and dating. I know many of you guys are curious about the hot pot video that we did. That whole sequence with uh, me, uh, the waitress at Spicy Pot like and the fact that I actually like approached her. <laughs> I want to make a video on why that is so important for guys to do. They should be able to have confidence and, and the balls to go up and approach a girl in a, in a proper manner, not in a creepy manner. So I'll, I'll make a video on that <laughs> in the future. Alright guys, Jason just arrived. He's in the lobby. He can't know that I didn't cut my hair yet. I told him that I wouldn't be revealing the hair until after he cuts his, so it shouldn't be a huge problem. <laughs> do, 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 do. Your turn, soldier. I bless, I bless you with my beard and hair set. Oh, that's legit. Yeah, dude, it's legit. Brown. Seven and one. Seven, Seven. And one. <laughs> Just like you. You're gonna, you can use the mirror for the indirect vision. Yeah. Oh, thanks. Now I'm gonna look like um, a hair model after this. <laughs> Where's this confidence coming from? I, I do have very nimble hands as an engineer. Which which a dentist doesn't have. Cause... We'll see, man. We'll see. <laughs> it's a Paxeroi version of... Sarangyeo. Sarangyeo. 사랑해요. 사랑한다고. See you in six months. 
I, I actually don't want to cut my hair to be honest. <laughs> I don't know if I am actually going to do well. It goes nothing. Oh, the size won't look that bad. Oh, what's good, bro? What's good, bro? Hey. <laughs> so, Peter, Jason already cut his hair. <laughs> I don't know what it looks like. <laughs> I haven't heard from him since yesterday. <laughs> Uh, just, just do your, just, just do your thing. All right. Just go pretend that this is a tooth. They just, just cut away. <laughs> so far, okay. I feel like if I even just stop now, it wouldn't be that bad. Okay, I just, just wash my hair once. But I don't know. It looks really good, but <laughs> I'm afraid that John went ape shit, and then I only got my sides in the back. Don't, don't feel any pressure. Honestly, like, even if you just. Even if you just cleaned it up a little bit, I'll be happy. It's gonna be weird if he, uh, <laughs> he's the only one who has fucked up that cut. Ah, oh, man. Yo. So I'd like a two millimeter fade on the side. And if you can, uh, please write J Bro right over here. Can you check my teeth too? <laughs> Amazing, bro. <laughs> this is this is aesthetic haircut. Looks fresh, bro. All right, it's the fun part. We're gonna video chat and reveal our haircuts. What's up? What's up, bro? You don't look that confident right now. Yo, you're gonna be mind blown, dude. Uh, hopefully, so hopefully in a bad way. You're gonna be so mind blown. <laughs> it, looks, it looks like you cut it pretty short. Alright, alright. You wanna go first? Should I go first? You, you should go first. No, no, you should go first. Rocks, paper, scissors, shoot! Ah, shit. Alright, I lost. You ready for these dentist hands? I already know it's gonna suck. <laughs> <laughs> Bro, this. These, yo, these are million dollar hands, bro. Alright, sure, whatever. It's time for the moment you've been waiting for! What's up, bro? What's up, bro? What's good, bro? What's good? That's actually, uh, not that bad. <laughs> what the hell did you... How'd you do it? Same, dude, same equipment, dude. Hey. It's not that hard. That's not no, what that's not what my hair looks like, but um. It's a long time. Let's see it, bro. Let's see it. <laughs> <laughs> Captain oh. Reed, forty. Hey, go to go to that, bro. I just came from North Korea. Dude, you look like the the science nerd picture that we posted a long time ago. <laughs> Yo, you look like Paxidoy, bro. Came back for you too in class. You look younger though, you look, you look younger. 
You did that. You did the face pretty well, though. I don't think so. My bag looks horrendous. I don't. I don't even want to show you my bag. It's, it's so bad. <laughs> it's because you've never done it with a mirror before. It looks like someone chewed on it. Let me see, bro. Cut your Yo man, I didn't, I didn't want to, I didn't, I didn't even want to cut it like this much. It was pretty good, and then I didn't want to cut you down. The challenge, so I like went ape shit. Uh, I, I gotta tell you a secret, bro. What is it? Don't hate me, bro. Wait, shut up. <laughs> I didn't cut my own hair. <laughs> Oh, my color resident cuts hair. Cut it for me today. Dude, you know how much it took for me to cut this hair? I, I almost cried cutting my hair, man. I know, I know, I know how much your hair means to you. Yeah, if you need, if you need, Peter's going to cut your hair too, to fix it. I, I let him know that you'll probably fuck up. Guys, um, it took a lot of convincing for me, for Jason to do this. He called me, Jason called me a few times to, uh, to reconsider the content. But, you know, I, I had to prank you, bro. I'm sorry. The content's going to get so good. From now on. <laughs> it's going to get all We're going to turn to a prank channel. We're going gonna to go like David Dobrik level. We're going to go... Uh... No, 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 no. Vitaly TV level. No, no, no. We're gonna go with Jimmy Zhang. From the top, shout out to my girlfriend Grace. Uh, it's her birthday next week, so if you like Dr. John's haircut, leave a comment. Tell her happy birthday. Happy birthday, Grace! Exceptional hand skills, exceptional man, in and out. We'll get there.